Okay, we are in the pit here. We're down in the basement of the EMI Studios where I recorded this new album. And um, there's nobody here right now, but when we were recording, I'll tell you where everybody was, because it was the same band. Let's see, let's start over here. Over in this thing, we had Mike Henderson, my co-producer, sitting in there. That's where his amps were. And then right here, we had Sam Bush on mandolin and fiddle. So you can picture Sam right there. <laughs> and then, uh, let's see. Um, right here was the bass. And Michael Rhodes on electric bass and Dennis Crouch on upright bass was right here. Uh, let's see, Jerry Douglas was sitting right there in this corner. That'd be Jerry Douglas. I only wish that I could do what he does, but I can't. And then in there, I was in that booth playing acoustic guitar and singing. And right in this booth, in the dark booth right in here, was John Gardner playing drums. And so that was the band. And basically it was the same band, uh, other than the fact that we switched bass players on a couple different days. Uh, it was this, oh, and then we had Kev, Kevin McKendry on piano, but he was in a whole other room on the other side because the studio is so small we couldn't fit everybody in the same place. Um, I finally decided what I'm going to call the album. I'm going to call it Johnny O, and uh, only because it's uh, it's kind of what what my nickname was when I was a kid, and these are all the like a lot of the songs that were my favorite songs when I was a kid. So I decided that's what I'm going to call it. And um, it's coming out amazing. And today we have Becca Bramlett singing background with me. And she, I just love singing with her. her. Our voices really seem to work together. And she would be standing right here. And she's in there now, but she would be standing right here. And um, so I don't know when it's going to come out, um, but um, I think it's probably going to be the first of the year. I'm thinking January because uh, Daryl and I are probably going to dedicate next year pretty much to a lot of solo projects. And we're still going to do our Hall & Oates shows. But uh, I think it's going to be kind of more oriented because he's doing an album as well. So that's where we're at. And uh, stay tuned. And um, thanks for uh, hanging in there.